guys, so today I'm going to be doing a video on my hair care routine. This was super requested, so I'm going to do it. And my hair's been really healthy lately, so I was like, why not do it now? Um, if you notice, my hair's not really, like, straight today. It's because it rained in my school. I have to walk through my classes through the campus outside, so that is why my hair's not really straight anymore. I get my hair highlighted. Um, I don't know really how often. I get it highlighted about, not every month, every two or three months. I don't get it highlighted too often. Um, my, as you can see, my roots are a little dark right now. My natural hair color is blonde. I am a blonde. Um, it's just that my hair started turning brown. So, I don't know. You might not. You can kind of tell my root color right here. So, I started getting highlights because it was really bad. It looked pretty disgusting. This is what it looks like in the back of the top. So for a while I was using um, a more kind of for professional brand of shampoo and conditioner. I was using um, Redken, but lately I've been using this Pantene Color Preserve and Shine shampoo and I'm using the same conditioner. So it's just like this. It's the Pantene Pro-V Color Hair Solutions and um, it's done really good to my hair. I, I've noticed it. It looks the same as it did when I used the Redken. So it's a lot cheaper and I decided to use this. You can just get the this at Target or anywhere like that. And every time I wash my hair, I use Ozzy 3 Minute Miracle. And um, yeah, this is really good. It's a, just a really good deep conditioner. Um, I've been through so many of these. This is probably my favorite hair product. One of my favorite hair products. And yeah, so this is a really, really great deep conditioner. I use it when I'm in the shower and you just let it, I let it soak for one song because I listen to music when I'm in the shower. So I let it soak for like one song in my hair while I shave or something and then I will rinse it out. And then when I'm in the shower, to rinse it out, I have a wide tooth comb in my shower. And once this is done soaking, I go with the wide tooth, I go with the wide tooth comb and I just brush out the conditioner and the tangles. The first thing I do is spray my hair with Chesme Platinum Strength Heat Protectant. Um, I take a shower every morning, so except on weekends, I don't wash my hair all weekend, but school day I wash it every day. And this is just a heat protectant, a Chesme, like I said, just spray it all over my hair. Since I started using this, my hair has been a lot shinier, so this might be why I've only been using it for about two weeks. Sometimes I'll use this got to be mega lift root boosting spray on my roots when I blow dry my hair but I don't use it that often. Renewing Moroccan oil by um it's extra penetration oil um for drying coarse hair. It's by Organics. I really really love this. Um it's a lot cheaper than ignore this the hair all over it but it's a lot cheaper than the regular Moroccan oil and it has done wonders for my hair. I've been through three of these. It is the best thing you can ever get for your hair. If I recommend one thing to get, get this. Like, out of everything, get this. It is like $3 at Target. It lasts a couple months, and I love it. I put it in my hair like when it's wet before I dry it, and it just makes my hair so soft and so shiny. Garnier Fruitiste also has one, Sleek and Shine Moroccan Oil, but I like that one better. But either one you can get, just definitely get an oil for your hair. I recommend getting a heat protectant, a deep conditioner and an oil for your hair. So, um, the next thing is a split end protector. This has definitely had an impact on my ends. This is by Ozzy. Um, like I said, right when my hair is wet, um, I do my makeup and then I take my hair out of the towel. I brush it and I use a regular brush. I know you're not supposed to, but my hair is just too tangly because it's colored. So I have to use a brush and I do that and then I spray the heat protectant, put the oil in and then put the split and protector just on my ends. And I don't put the oil up here, I just put the oil like from my ear down and really concentrate on the ends and then spray the heat protectant everywhere. And then the split end, um, what, whatever it's called, split end cream, split end, I don't know, split end mender protector on just my ends. So, kind of hit the name. And then, and then I dry my hair. This is my hair dryer. It's just a Remington. I got it in like sixth grade. Um, it's from Target. It does the job. My hair, I have very, very thick hair, and it only takes about, like, anywhere from 5 to 10 minutes to dry. It doesn't take too long, um, which I'm really surprised, but I don't have a way to dry my hair. I just kind of dry it, 
like that. I don't know what like that is. I just kind of dry it and then um, I'll flip my head over. But I always dry it facing down. You do not want to dry it facing up because that's going to make all your flyaways go up and not good. So yeah. And then once my hair is almost all the way dry, I take this round brush. It's from Walmart. It's by Goody. And I just go like that with my blow dryer down and then just... Um, then I just blow dry my hair and it makes it a lot straighter. Next, um, I will either straighten my hair or curl it. If I have a little bit more time in the morning, I'll curl it. Um, and then if I don't, I'll straighten it. Simple as that. Um, or if it's raining, I'll straighten it. Like today, I straighten it and so I use the Remington, um, it's something frizz straightener. I got it at Target. It's purple. Really, really good straightener. It was around $30. I did have a professional Cortex one, um, for a while. I've had that since like fifth grade, and then it just broke on me a couple months ago. So I got this one, and it has done pretty good so far. Um, my hair's pretty straight when I get it out of when I'm done drying it. So I just go over my ends with this. I don't straighten my whole hair. I just straighten what needs to be straightened so I can avoid the heat. And then for curling iron, I use a bedhead TGI curling iron when I do curl my hair. And then oh. When I, straight, ugh, when I straighten my hair, I use another heat protectant. This is Garnier Fructis, um, Sleek and Shine Flat Iron. Sorry, this is Garnier Fructis Flat Iron Protector Spray, um, straightening mist, whatever. I put this on my dry hair before I straighten it, and then I'll go like put my jewelry on, come back, it'll be dry, then I'll straighten my hair. Um, and then lastly, the hairspray I use is the Aussie Mega Hairspray. I don't know if I really love this. Um, it smells, smells good. Hold on. I don't know really how to describe the smell. It just smells really good, but nothing special. It's just a hairspray. It's cheap. You can get it at Target. So yeah, that is my hair care routine. Um, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.